required to neonatal unit, room one, Princess Anne. Crashing required, neonatal unit, room one, Princess Anne. Thanks for coming, crash team. Please assume TABC crash positions and I will give you an SBAR handover.
This is a baby born at term mm -hmm. who is 37 weeks of gestation. Mm -hmm. uh, there was rupture of membranes. Mm -hmm. uh, the baby was born and I was called to review the baby by the midwifery team, but actually the baby had very poor respiratory mm -hmm. efforts. Mm -hmm. So I've given this baby five inflation breaths, good chest wall movement. Mm -hmm. uh, the heart rate, which was below 60 when I came, is now above 100, but the baby's not breathing. Uh, and we are approximately 10 minutes old. So we've got to make a plan. I think this baby's probably going to need intubation. Uh, what do you think? Uh, then uh, an alternate airway intubation. Yeah, yeah. I think mean, that's what we're going to do. Uh, we have a term baby who had a normal delivery with a um, antenatal, postnatal hemorrhage, found to be an hour old, having grunting. Uh, on arrival, stats were poor uh, and temperature was low. We warmed the baby, we used to peep initially and then the heart rate dropped and we needed to do full CPR for approximately, well that's ongoing and we have been doing that for the past six and a half minutes. The ET tubes it appears to be in the right position with good bilateral air entry and CO2 change. With sats of about 95 and baby looks a pink. Um, we don't think at the moment we need surfactant so we can prioritize the other baby because we have good sets. Okay. A recap please guys. So team one first, would you like to recap where you are at 10 minutes? Yeah, so we have got a tube in and we are continuing with ventilation breaths. We have got a good pathway to more than 100. Our sets are a bit low in 70s, but we are already on 100% of oxygen. So my needs are surfactant. I'd like to give some surfactant this point of time. Okay, so airway breathing, yeah. circulation. Circulation wise, got a UVC in, has received 10 mils per kilo of normal saline bolus, and we have asked for the O negative blood and mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And mm -hmm. that was given another 10 mils per kilo of sleeping. Okay, team B. Team B, our baby is um, intubated now and has um, a heart rate of uh, with SATs of about 95, and baby looks pink. Um, we don't think at the moment we need surfactant so we can prioritize the other baby because we have good sets. Okay, well done.